Hello guys, Creative Vision here as you can see and I just want to say thanks for helping me reach over 2,000 subscribers and I wouldn't be anywhere without your help. Um, and so this is a video on how to make a cool look, um, cool color correction to make normal footage look awesome. So as you can see this is this is normal footage, this is the color corrected one and this is how normal footage looks like. Pretty boring. So, as you can see, you can make any random camera that you have. Um, hopefully, it's going to be good quality. You know, uh, make it look awesome. There's also another one right here um, where I just slide the camera, and there's like money right here. So, let's just take a look how it's going to look with this is with color correction. This is without color correction, so as you can see, it's it's more like a blockbuster look. Um, so this is in case if you don't have any like kind of presets or anything, this is what you can achieve with that um, color correction. So let's just make a new composition. I'll just duplicate this one. Um, edit duplicate. I'll open it and just delete this. So I just um, just drop your footage here. I'm just gonna use this one because I think it looks better than everything else. And go to any point um, where the image looks sharp. So like where when you see the details, it's not blurred too much because if you take a look here, you can see it's blurred and you don't see it as great. So anywhere where you can actually see the details, pretty good. Um, so right here would be good. So what you need to do now is go to layer, new adjustment layer. And it doesn't matter, just I'll call it CC for color correction. And this I'll call this video. So choose the color correction layer and type in levels. And choose in color correction levels and apply it to CC and it doesn't have any presets it doesn't do anything yet but this is what it's gonna do um, so when you move this um, the contrast of the video goes up so you put it all the way up it becomes super white so just put it up a little it so it won't make too much of a difference and put the side down so it'd be a little darker now I think it's way too red so instead of red green blue which is everything go to red um, or whatever color you think there's too much on this video and just put it down um, until it looks quite nice and you can also move the middle one to adjust it a little more so and the next thing I used is type in tint and also apply it to CC right now it's completely black and white um, and as you can see you can change it to any color you want um, but I go into black and white and I just lower it down a little so it'd be like um, kind of like half black and white half colored um, so then when you look at it it looks really nice um, so let me just play around a little more with the colors you know maybe put it down a little the red down also a little more maybe the blue one too um, so what else you can um, also something you can do is just um, copy the video uh, command C command V to copy and paste and um, I use this also for photo editing. Um, that, that's just me. Um, so, um, okay, I say um too much. Uh, type in blur. And I use fast blur all the time. Um, so just go and put in fast blur and increase it. Um, and as you can see, it will be way too blurry right now. Um, and it just like cuts off right here, which looks stupid. 
you'll agree with me, but um, when you click on this little arrow and you go into mask, change it to subtract, and feather it out a little. Uh, feather it, and the edges, like you can decrease the edges a little. So, actually, um, I'm going to do this over again. Just double click on this. And I'll make a cool mask. Fast blur. I don't know, 20 should be good enough. Um, it looks pretty good. Subtract. Feather. And also, I would go into levels again and just make it really dark. So as you can see, there's like a, a vignette, a vignette border, which looks quite nice. Um, actually, I think it looks really nice. Um, so you could save this as a picture, or whatever you like to do. But this was the tutorial tutorial for a cool color correcting look. So let's just scroll th through the video right here, and you'll see how cool it looks. So well, this is how much I made, and as you can see, it looks cool. I used a like a crappy camera. It's like a, a flip, but it's not a flip. Um, it's not too. It records staying in the ADP, but it's not you know DSLR cameras, so it won't be too great. Um, so and hopefully I'm getting a DSLR camera soon. But this was the video I made. So I hope you liked it. I hope this tutorial helped. Um, now you can make really cool videos with cool color correction. If you shoot a city, the city will look really nice. Not actually like shoot a city, like a video record a city, in case you got a little confused there. Um, so yeah, uh, thank you. If you'd subscribe, that'd be nice, um, helpful, you know, watch my videos, like them, favorite them, that helps me. Um, and actually, check out this channel, uh, LucasDTV, he's my friend actual friend in real life, We're like best friends. He makes like um pretty funny pretty cool videos. You know, they're like vlogging and they're funny. Like the amazing eye potato. It's cool, you know, how to make a Nutella sandwich, you know, swimming tryouts. All this fun stuff as you can see he's cool. Cool kid. Um so yeah. Um I hope you guys like this tutorial. Um comment below if you need um, any help on anything, like if you want me to make a tutorial on how to motion track explosions or how to record videos good or how to be cool like me, you know, anything like that, um, any effects, anything you want, um, just feel free to ask me. I'll be happy to help you. Oh, I never knew what this does. But, oh well, um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Yeah, pretty much said everything. So bye. Damn it, I can't find the button. All right. Anyway, thanks.